Well, hey. what I was about to say is that the conditions of organizing are going to be cha uh, changing before our eyes. And my perception, because I did this study for 802, Mark really pushed them. He Just became remind, 802 is local of which union? American Federation of Musicians, and it's the biggest local of the musicians' union nationally, and it's a very big local, 10,000 members, I guess. But it, they used to be, for Broadway uh, musicians and for concert musicians, the New, York, New York Philharmonic, and for weddings and funerals and bar mitzvahs, you know, that was 802. And now they have a wholly different situation. And you said in your introduction, I think correctly in your lead-in, that are you an entrepreneur? Are you a worker? And maybe that distinction doesn't matter anymore. Well, but from what Mark's saying, and, and Morley is saying, oh, it does matter. Well, it matters, in, it matters in so far as you can't exclude somebody because they're an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. And they are, in many ways, at the mercy of the large corporations. They're at the mercy of a market which is rapidly changing, and the union has to learn as well as AFTER and others, they have to learn how to organize these new groups of people under new conditions. How do, you, how do you make money out of a website? How do you make money out of the internet? How do you make money out of Twitter? I mean, these are issues that have to be addressed and they're not being addressed. We, went, we had a forum, uh, uh, Mark and I and some other people, and musicians showed up in droves yeah. because they want answers to these questions and, and generally speaking, they're not getting it from the union. <laughs>